You are watching Alabama's WVUA News, first at four. Beautiful day out there today. Tuscaloosa County Parks and Recreation has a special fundraiser coming up for a special group of athletes. And here to tell us more about it is Kayla Carruthers from Tuscaloosa County Parks and Recreation. Kayla, thanks so much for being with us today. Thank you. It is our pleasure to have you. It's, uh, it's called the, the Be Brave 5K. Now, mm -hmm. what is that? It is a special Olympic fundraiser that we've put together to um, benefit the local Tuscaloosa County special athletes. Um, generally, special athletes, like our, our guys, come from really low income and fixed income, so they can't afford to participate in Special Olympics unless we do fundraisers like oh. this. So we're really pushing to get as much sponsorship and involvement as we possibly can because I cannot even tell you how excited they get when they slip on a new uniform. If everybody could see that, then there would be no question. There would be no need for any kind of funding whatsoever. Because there would be plenty of money for Yes, it. there would be. Well, let's talk about the name of the fundraiser. Why did y'all decide to name it that? I decided to call it the Be Brave 5K because the kind of intimidation that I would feel by tackling a 5K and the courage that it would I would have to summon to meet that challenge is the same intimidation and courage that my special athletes have to summon every single day to overcome obstacles in their life. So, you know, we can all be brave for one day because they're brave every single day. Well, tell us a little bit about uh, the Be Brave 5K. What, what will the guys be, and gals be doing? Um, well, it's a 5K run or walk. You don't have to run it. You just you show up and we'll get you set up. It's $20 for registration in advance, $30 at the gate, and you run the race. And then we'll have a big awards banquet afterwards where you kind of get to see all the people that you're influencing and impacting their lives. And we'll give awards to the winners of the race. And then we're going to have an awesome after party <laughs> where um, <laughs> it's going to be at Green Bar. The awards banquet's at Will Hagen's. But the, at Green Bar, we're having um, a band called the Burning Angels from Athens, Georgia. And the lead singer is also a special, um, yeah, special needs teacher in public school system. So really? his heart's in it, too. But they're super talented, and I'm really excited that we finally got them to come out here, and I think that everybody should take advantage of the opportunity to come and hear them, even if they aren't part of the race. And so the, the 5K starts at Timerson Square. It ends at Timerson Square. Yep. The, uh, the awards banquet is, is in uh, Will Hagen's Hagen. restaurant. And then uh, you go next door for the after party, mm -hmm. which is Green Bar. And, and what was the name of the band again? Uh, Burning Angels out of Athens. Burning Angels out of Athens. Mm -hmm. Well, it sounds like it's going to be a really good time. Really quick, we're almost out of time. Uh, if the folks at home want to pre-register, you mentioned that it's ten dollars. Yeah, cheaper, it's um, ten dollars cheaper to pre-register. You can do it online at tcpara.org, or you can come to any one of the centers. And if you'd like to make a donation to the 5K, you can do that at any Para Center or Foundation or Para Foundation. Write a check and send it to us. All right, super. Kayla, thank you so much for being with thank us. Thank you. The Be Brave 5K. K is Sunday, April 15th at Timerson Square. The race starts at 2 p.m. You can register online at tcpara.org, and you can find out more by calling 205-562-3220.